In this video, we're going to sketch the region of integration of this integral, and we're going to switch the limits of integration. Let's go ahead and start by sketching the region. So first, notice that x is going from 0 to y. So let's draw a picture. So x equals 0 is a vertical line like this. And x equals y is the same as y equals x. It's a line that looks like this. Right? And it goes all the way down like this. We have x equals 0, and then we have x equals y. It's the same thing as y equals x. Now we're told that y goes from 0 to 2 because we have dy. So y is going from 0 to 2. So here's 2. And so that pretty much gives us our region here. Now we can erase this piece. And we know we're just looking at this, at this triangle here. So let me do that again from scratch one more time, uh, just to make sure you got it. So again, first you do x, so you're going from x equals 0 to x equals y. So x equals 0 is a vertical line, so that's this line here. x equals y is like y equals x, so it looks like this. Then you look at this one, this tells you that y goes from 0 to 2. So y goes from 0 to 2, so here's 2. And then that's how you see that it's just this triangle. That's your region of integration. So now we want to switch the limits. So let's go ahead and do that. So we have f of x, y. And now we have dy, dx. Okay, to switch the limits, first we're doing y. So we have to think about y. So it's top minus bottom. So we're going from y equals 2 is on the top. And y equals x is on the bottom. You could think of a, of a rectangle if you like. Right? It's a, you can think of a rectangle, it's 2 minus x, that would be the, the height of the rectangle, so 2 to x, easy way to think about it. And now we do our x values, so we're going from 0 to 2, so left to right, up, bottom to up. And that would be the final answer. Again, let me just go through the whole thing one more time. So first we're going from x equals 0 to x equals y, so x equals 0 to x equals y. And then y equals 0 to y equals 2, so it gives us a rectangle. Then we're changing the limits. First, we're doing dy. So if we're doing dy, we're going from x to 2, from x to 2, from x to 2, from x to 2. Or you can think of it as top minus bottom. 2 goes up top, x goes on the bottom. Both ways of thinking work and will always give you the right answer. And then x, from the picture, x is going from 0 to 2, so 0 to 2. I hope this video has been helpful. Take care.